Jürgen, today was all about Stephen Derby. Pleasing that as a football club you managed to show your support today. Yeah, very, very important information, I would say. If you play one game for Liverpool, first team, or, or 400, doesn't matter. Um, with one game, at least with one game, with one training session, probably are one of us. And that's what the, play, what the club showed today. And um, his actual club um, showed it as well. So really nice an opportunity for us to show uh, the support for Stephen and his family. What did you make of the game itself? Because it was a uh, changed teams in, in both halves. And uh, the first half, you, you looked very, very comfortable. Yeah, the first 30 minutes, I would say, we were very confident. Did the right things in the right moment, and he lost the rhythm and didn't get it back, to be honest. And it was a bit, uh, looked a bit more rusty. That's how it is in pre season very often. Took the wrong decisions and all that stuff. But scored still a wonderful third goal, which uh, to his striker goal of, of Rian. Really nice. The goals, that, uh, anyway, were really, really good. Um, and uh, yeah, second half. We need, never really could get the rhythm, so it was. Yeah. I said it already, a bit boring to be honest. If you don't have, if you are not creative on a, on a specific day, then you have to use the, the simple solutions constantly. Then you need to be still direct, try to become the last line. But these passes around, yeah, that, that, that's a bit waste of time. So, but it's normal. Huh? You have to, you have to feel things like this. You have to do the things like this. Then the manager has to criticize you, and then make like the next step, and then everything is good again. Are these games an opportunity for some of the young players to force their yeah, way into please. your first team plans? What the mean? likes of Harry Wilson and, and Kent? Oh, how I said, the door is always open, the boys have only to go through by themselves, so that's always like this in each pre-season, yeah, and, um, of course. Jürgen, yeah, can I ask you about left-back and the cover for left-back? You lost Moreno, obviously, in the summer. Um, do you think the solution is internal in terms of cover? Because Robertson's going to play most of your games, I guess. We will see. <laughs> yeah, that's not a yes, that's see. not a no. I know. Is it no? That's a no. That's, that's a no. The cover's not no. internal. No, it's not, a, it's not a yes, not a no. No. <laughs> so, no, we will see. What can I say? Yeah, I said already, we have, to, we, we have to think about everything and about and at the end maybe we do nothing, but we will see that. But of course we are, we should be, um, yeah. I can imagine we, 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 we have a look on all the things around us. Yeah, of course we lost the left back, but we have today you saw two pretty young ones. James played it and all that stuff. Yeah, that's it. We will see. Yeah, you, using the Adam in a bit of a deeper midfield role, it looks yeah, like. Yeah, What's yeah. that thinking there on the change? Oh, it's just where Berg is, yeah. Adam is his kind of player, he can play that. Um, he enjoys it, obviously, a lot. Uh, it's his <laughs> Jorginho role, if you want. Uh, I hope Mauricio Sarri doesn't see the games, otherwise, probably he makes an offer. Um, so, yeah, it's about getting, getting Adam the rhythm, bring him in and give him the, 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 the things he, 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 he's naturally good in small spaces, giving the ball, passing the ball, and all that stuff. And, and then from time to time offering the runs in behind as well, and especially together with Midi, that's possible. But it's just uh, um, for us another option. Yeah. We always saw every, every pre-season, he always looks so good, he comes back, he just needs that bit of a bit of luck. No, a bit of luck now, of course, how we all need in life. Eh? Yeah, 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 that's true. Yeah, without, we have to come through with that without interest, that would be good. If that's good, then we have, uh, and then we have a couple of new players, I would say, this season. Any final ones, Sorry? Simon Mickey stay. Yeah. Oh, I've heard. You had a conversation with him? A lot of conversations in the last couple of years, months, and. No, not weeks, but months. Yeah. yeah. yeah but before we left, we had a clear talk. Yeah. I, would, I would say yes. Yeah. Is that because you value his professionalism and his attitude in that role? Yeah, it's, uh, I think it's because uh, as a club uh, like Liverpool, you need two number ones at least um, in the club because um, and we have that. That's cool with Ali and, and Simon. That's a very good situation for the club, but the, the situation I think you should have, and um, that's why everything is fine from my point of view. Last one, guys. Thank you so much, to win today. How are you going to prepare for the season where everyone wants to win against the European champions? <laughs> To be honest, I didn't. Last year we were second in Europe, and everybody wanted to win against us. So I can't believe that when, I, when we went to Newcastle, I thought, okay, what are we playing here today for? It was really intense. Eh? It felt like a World Cup, and um, I don't think there's can come more even, but it, it will be tough, like always. Like always, it's if you, as Liverpool. That's I had to learn that pretty quick. With the Liverpool team to go somewhere, they're all 
really on their toes. Um, that was never different. Yeah, but we will be prepared for that for sure. Thanks, guys. You are welcome.